And the River State Chapter of the Royal Progressive Congress has alleged that the state governor, Seminalai Fubara, is plotting to procure interim orders to declare the state House of Assembly illegal. Also, the state's main opposition party said Fubara's outburst on Wednesday while addressing members of the Nigerian Union of Local Government Employees in Government House, Port Harcourt. The state capital was drumming war and disrespect for President Bola Tinubu. The state APC caretaker committee chairman, Tony Okocha, disclosed this during a media briefing in Port Harcourt on Thursday. Governor Fubara's warning of springing unpleasant surprises if dead is to Mr. President, then it is the highest height of insult to Mr. President and the Office of President. Two, if the threat is to the Speaker and other 26 members of the River State of Assembly who have been asserting their independence and consistent with the principles of separation of powers and checks and balances, and in making laws and promoting laws for the prosperity of River State, then the governor groups again. <clears throat> if this threat <clears throat> is targeted at the All Progressive Congress River State, who has sustained its role as main opposition party in the state and had remained unequivocal and vehement in speaking for the mass of our people, including the Dan Trodden, then he misfired as usual. That threat is empty completely, completely empty. Four, if the threat is to his estranged benefactor, who is His Excellency Yen Wike, Honorable Minister of FCT, then it will not be out of place to define Governor Kubara as a serial immigrant. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.